Welcome to part two of Cool Ancient Civilizations Facts. If you missed part one, you can find the link in the video description. Here are 10 more facts that are also odd, but fascinating facts. Number one. In ancient Egypt, men could take time off from work to care for menstruating wives and daughters. Drawing on a wide variety of evidence, from laundry lists detailing the cleaning of soiled sanitary towels to a vast attendance register currently on display at the British Museum. It is evident that the menstrual cycle intricately linked women's and men's life in ancient Egypt. This monthly event necessitated men's practical involvement in their women's life. In ancient Egypt, many men took time out of work to care for their menstrual daughters and spouses. The start of their wives, daughters, or even daughters-in-law's monthly periods provided a legit reason for the men to take a break from their work. Number 2. Spike dog collars were originally designed to protect the dog's throat from wolf attacks. Dogs were most likely domesticated in Greece to protect herds against wolves, but the bond evolved through time to shared love and respect. While the most basic dog collar was also developed in Greece, the Egyptians most probably influenced subsequent ones. A basic collar would have been worthless against a wolf's jaws. Hence the spiked collar was invented. The Greek collars were made of metal or leather and were put on farm dogs. The metal collars were chain-linked with spikes, while the leather collars had the spikes inserted through the leather strap and attached from the back by rivets. The spiked metal collar was used not just to protect farm guard dogs from wolves, but also for wolf baiting. Wolf baiting was a legal method of wolf control and a form of sport. Number 3. The ancient Aztecs and Incas invented peanut butter. Despite what many people think, George Washington Carver didn't invent peanut butter. Unquestionably, he was one of America's greatest inventors, developing over 300 uses for peanuts, including shampoo, chili sauce, shaving cream, and adhesives, but not peanut butter. The earliest mention of peanut butter is dated back to the ancient Aztecs and Incas, who mashed roasted peanuts into a paste and used it as food. On the other hand, modern peanut butter, its manufacturing technique, and the machinery used to create it can be attributed to at least three inventors, Marcellus Gil Moredson, Dr. John Harvey Kellogg, and Dr. Ambrose Straub of St. Louis. Number 4. The Mayans used to play a ball game in which those who lost would become a sacrifice. Experts believe that all cultures in the country played the Mesoamerican Mayan ball game, beginning with the Olmecs, who may have developed it. The Mayan ball game dates back 3,500 millennia, rendering it the first professional sport in history. The game was popular among the Mayans, and everyone participated at various points. It also had great religious and ritual significance. As a result, it was occasionally played simply as a game, with a lot of betting on the teams. At other times, the game evolved into a spectacle and a ceremony, with city rulers engaging imprisoned warriors in fixed, ritual games. The captives would lose the match and be sacrificed as a result. Number 5. The first person in history whose name we know is Kushim. The earliest name in recorded human history is not that of a king, warrior, or poet. His name is Kushim, and he worked as an accountant around 3200 BC. In Yuval Noah Harari's book, A Brief History of Humankind, said 5,000-year-old stone tablets discovered in Mesopotamia were found, engraved with dots brackets and small designs and appears to document a business transaction. The tablet, a receipt for multiple barley shipments, reads 29,086 measures, barely 37 months Kushim. 
The most likely interpretation of this statement is, I sum of 29,086 measures of barley were delivered throughout 37 months, signed Kushim. Number 6. The ancient Persian built a device which could store ice even in the middle of summer. Engineers developed a sustainable system to preserve ice during the blazing summer in the hot, arid deserts of ancient Persia circa 400 BC, long before the creation of electricity. Yakul, as it was called, were prehistoric evaporative coolers having an above-ground pyramidal shape and an underground storage room for food, ice, and other consumables. This efficient method of keeping ice in the desert may appear complex, Yet, it was an essential technology that even the masses could afford. During the winter, ice was collected from neighboring mountains and carried to the actual. Many also had tunnels known as cuinats to convey water from nearby sources. Number 7. The shortest war in history only lasted 38 minutes. Anglo-Zanzibar War, which transpired on August 27, 1896, was a brief battle between the East African island Sultanate of Zanzibar and the British Empire. Following the death of the former Sultan, Zanzibari Prince Khalid Ibn Bargish refused to acknowledge the British Empire's designated heir and occupied the Sultan's palace, prompting imperial vessels to fire on his position. The conflict lasted between 38 and 45 minutes, earning it the shortest in recorded history. Quite embarrassing for Prince Khalid. Number 8. Ancient Greeks inscribed their ammunition with insults. When slingshots were popular, Greeks and Romans fashioned football-shaped ammo out of lead. For Roman and Greek soldiers, Blasting a massive bullet at an enemy wasn't always enough. Armies have been known to heat up their munitions to set fire to thatched roofs. Other times, they engraved the items with the deity's name to guarantee the bullet stayed true and hit its target. The most painful shots, however, had to be those etched with insults and sarcasm. This is outright bullying if you'd ask me. Number 9. Ancient Rome had takeout restaurants. Fast food has existed for a long time. Even ancient civilizations wished for a location where they might stop for a hot meal. The ancient Romans called this thermopalia. The term literally means places where hot drinks are sold. Most restaurants in ancient Rome were housed in small rooms with enormous countertops in front of them. The thermopolium's primary purpose was to offer takeout food. However, some location also included small dining rooms. The thermopolium was a practical invention because many Romans did not have the time or resources to prepare meals at home. Hence, they became reliant on these omnipresent cafes. Now you know that takeouts are not modern inventions. Number 10. Ancient Greeks invented the first computer. More than 21 centuries ago, Greek scientists devised a device known as the Antikythera Mechanism. The Antikythera Mechanism used brass gear wheels to anticipate the movements of the Sun, Moon, and most likely most planets, effectively becoming the world's first computer. The Antikythera Mechanism, discovered by Greek sponge divers in an ancient shipwreck, provides new insights into the history and challenges conventional preconceptions about technology transfer over time. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please make sure you like the video, subscribe to this channel, and don't forget to hit the notification bell.